Hello and welcome back to another episode of Building for Beginners with Love from Tom. Today we're going to be building the cow shed. Yes, that's right, we're going to be building the cow shed. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's not particularly fancy, but we're going to get into fancier ones. You, 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 just, you just watch, it's going to get a hell of a lot better than this. This is just uh, this is just a representation of one of the things I, I used to build, and it's it's not particularly amazing, but some of the things I've seen, this is a hell of a lot better than some of those. Now, it may not be as fancy as that, and it's it's odd. I've always always built houses with cobblestone roofs, and anything with like animals and stuff, just with a with a wooden roof, and it's just completely reversed. It you can see that you've got wooden walls there, stone walls there, stone roof there, and wooden roof there. I don't know why I do it. I just, I just do. Um. Oh, this is supposed to be a, a cow shed. You're a cat. Get back here. Will you? Come here, Fluffy. Come back, Fluffy. Um. I'm never gonna see that thing. Again. Oh, there's a sheep over there. He's escaped as well. Oh, I'm never gonna see that cat again. <sighs> You're gonna be missed, Fluffy. I'm gonna. At least I got your brothers. Yeah. Oh no, no, I'm not going in there anymore. It's Tiddles. <laughs> Come back here, Tiddles. <laughs> not funny anymore. Right, okay, let's get on with the build, shall we? Basically, you're going to need an 18 times 9 square. So if we just go... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 1, 2, 3... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. There you go. As you can tell, I was amazing at maths back when I was in school. Alright, okay. Let's make a square like this. You don't want to finish it off completely. You want to leave two squares like this and do that. Then you want to bring this in about that far. If you want, or you can do that far. doesn't really matter. Right, from here we're going to put down one wall there and one wall there. Can you see that? It's like a little spirally bit. It's lovely. From there we're going to put in a gate here and a gate there. You know what, actually, I want to fill in this floor because, you know, our, our cows are going to escape from here. You would have thought that I would have... Uh, done this before starting the video, but no, I'm not, I'm not that clever, I'm afraid. Oh, well, I'll make a point whilst I'm here. Never leave the dirt underneath it, it just looks silly. Because you do that, and it turns to dirt, like that, look. And that's not what a building looks like, it's got foundations. Where's the foundations? Come on, put some foundations in there. There we go. Look at that, look, that looks a lot nicer. Look, look, look how silly that looks. You, you wouldn't see that in real life. Pop that in there. So it goes all the way through. Even if it doesn't, I mean, look, that's there, but it's hidden. So there you go, look, look at that. That's a lot nicer. Alright, next thing we are going to do is going to be a 1, 2, then we're going to go 1, 2, 1, 2, and then a third one like that. So the long ones, or the, the, the two ends, are going to be 3 high, and the sides are going to be 2 high. You, you'll understand why I'm doing this in a moment. Wow, they're all out tonight, aren't they? Alright, as you can see, that's the corners. Alright, then we're going to put in one like that, and one like that. That's a stone wall. And one like that, one like that. One like that, one like that. Right, that's all done. Alright, you're going to place another one on top of there, and another one on top of there. Then we're going to come over here, and pop those up like that. Are we going to do that? No, we're not doing that. Oh, these are supposed to be too high, sorry. Righty doody. Right, next thing on the list is to get the roof on. Because you've got to have a roof. Now, I, it really is such a bad idea building it with a, with a wooden roof. So if you want to reverse this, you might as well. Because, like, you, if, say, if lightning strikes or something, you're going to lose half this roof. But... I don't know, I've always done it like this. And uh, later, I'm, I'm, the next series of building I'm going to be doing is uh, for advanced builders. And uh, it, it covers a lot more in-depth decoration, really. And it's... Uh, it 
it's, it's a hell of a lot more fancy, trust me. If you ever have a look at my cover page on, on this uh, on this YouTube channel, you'll see that I've uh, taken a screenshot of the, the village where, which I'll be uh, touring you around. And it's it's quite it's quite something. Me and uh, me and my housemate, who's um Carslake, who's in the uh, uh the other series I'm doing, which is Tom's Extravagant Adventure. If you haven't seen that, check that out because that's uh, that's pretty fun. I have a lot of fun doing that. But I'm uh, I'm trying to figure out why I can't hear Mike because he can't hear his voice at all. Well, not really, at least. So I need to figure that out before I start posting some more up. One and two are out. But yeah, you might have to wait a little bit for those. Yeah, and once again. With the roofs, you ju you don't want to fill this entire wall in. You just want to come up like that, so it leaves this big hole in the middle, and, and it'll b become apparent in a bit. Especially if you're building a barn, because you you don't generally see that, you know. Or m maybe I'm making it up. I can't really remember. I don't think I've actually vi ever visited a barn or ever been in a barn. But we'll uh, we'll see. Oh no, I have been in a barn actually. There was a tractor in it, and it was a red tractor. I do remember there was a cow as well, not an ocelot, <laughs> like in uh, like in mine. Maybe it's a, ju it's a jungle one. That's what it is. It's jungles. All right, let's get these roofs on. Oh look, let's uh, we can farm some zombies. Seem to want to get in on the action. What the hell's that? Oh, it's a sheep. I thought it was a wolf. He's trying to get in there. Look. They just, they're just flooding in. They just they just want to be a part of this. Look, look. This is what I'm talking about. Hello, Mr. Cow. You are going to be my beef. How'd you like that? Right, now that we've finished the roof, as you can see, we're going to put some torches on top because you don't... Uh, trust me, I've seen it plenty of times. You're walking along out of nowhere. It's a huge, dark, empty space and you get mobs spawning all over it. I've died countless times from skeletons that I just cannot get to because it's up a hill. You, d you just want you just want to end it now. Put in your torches. Keep the roof, you know, like all lit up and stuff. I know I haven't done it many for that one, but you know, it might demonstrate in a bit. Right. Next step we're gonna do is put in the cobblestone walls around the edges. Right, you, uh, you see I missed a space here and I'll show you why. I'll put that in there actually. You know what, actually no, I'm, I'm going to switch this up a bit. I'm surprised I'm going to do it right, right now. All right. How we did it with these, that end piece. Didn't do it with this end piece. You're going to do that because it's, it's like roof supports, you know. So that's what we're going to do that end. And then what you can do is three in, so you go one, two, three. And then down again. Because you, you can't just have like an open expanse of flat rock because you wouldn't see rock floating. Well, I suppose this is wood, but it's not floating. You, you, you get the idea. Right. Come on, zombie. There's room for you as well. Now I'm going to pop in the walls. Right, we're doing this just so that it's. Uh, yeah, that's what, I'm, that's what I'm doing. We're doing this so that our, our animals can't escape. Pretty much. We're going to leave it like that. Uh, and come back to that in a moment. I'm just going to put this wall in. Alright, Mr. Sheep, are you going in or out? Come on, come on. Out of the way. There's a good sheep. Oh, look, hello. Alright, mate. How you doing? Alright, you know what? Let's get some torches in there because this is, this is too dark. Too dark. There we go. That's actually going to defeat the objective of uh, what I'm planning on doing in a minute, but still. There we go. Um, right, okay. Next step is to do this. Right, get two in on the lowest block on the first level. Okay, and then right in the middle you plop that. A solid block. Because then you can put a torch on both sides, but you can't put a torch on these ones. So that's what you do there. Oh, come on. Come on. Why do they all want to get in here? Am I, I'm just that lovable. You know, it's channels with love from Tom. 
And that they all just want a piece of the love. There's, there's love to go around, guys. Come on. Come on. All you sheep, all you zombies. Hello, hello baby. How you doing? Wow, you, you're mag looking a magnificent green today. If you're wondering what the, uh, the, the texture pack is I'm using, it's um, uh, the Faithful 64x64 texture pack. It's brilliant. I mean, have a look at this diamond sword. Where's the diamond sword? There's a diamond sword. Look, it looks like a sword. It's lovely. Bang. I'm, I'm sorry, you, you weren't worth my time. And you. I like big girls, not skinny ones. Let's put that back in there, because we don't want that. Alright. Let's go. Oh, come on! There we go. Are you staying in, sheep? You can stay here. He's my bro. I'm gonna name him Mike. Alright, there we go. And on that, that inside one as well, we're gonna put some of those. There we go. And let's see if I've missed anything. Because I've noticed I missed a few things last time. Oh yes, I know what I've missed. Boom, 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 boom. I want you in my room. There we go. Put some cobblestone in there. The reason I use cobblestone a lot is because in my survival worlds, I've always found that cobblestone is very much of abundance. So and it's it's resistant to creeper blasts. It's just great stuff if you ever have cobblestone. It, it, Obviously, it's up to you if you like the aesthetic look of it, but I, I personally like it. Uh, a lot of people don't. They can deal with it. I couldn't care. So yeah, that's uh, that's that built. So you know, subscribe, like my videos, have a look at the other stuff, and uh, I hope you have a good day.